Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. More Star Renegades tonight. Last time we got our start on this spacey sci-fi RPG adventure thing. It turns out it's pretty cool. Good mechanics going on here, and we've learned a little bit about the characters. Um, got the the protag with the tragic backstory and our... Let's see if we can pull them up. Here we go. Uh, protag with tragic backstory on the right there, win. Uh, we've got our weird spiritual robot dude, Zerks. Our uh, budget Han Solo there, Noto. And then we just picked up uh, our healer, uh, Senya there, our empath, I suppose. Um, I have no idea um, what I'm going to do with her. <laughs> like, I've got nothing to give there. Nothing. No inventory, no equips. Just on just barely terms with everybody else since we just hired her, I guess. Well, we didn't hire her so much as recruit her. Um, so let's get going. Uh, should we talk to General Scene too much here? No. Or, uh, uh, Professor Time Travel? Not Time Travel. Reality Hopping, I guess, is the, is the name of the game here. Whatever. Let's go. Let's, let's go to the next planet. Look at that! See, there's our... There's our stuff going on there. We did a pretty good job. Nobody died, everybody survived. And, uh, we did all we could. So to, to the next planet, I suppose. Um, no, we can't go to the one that's marked harsh, unfortunately. Uh, probably for the best. We're probably not ready for a harsh planet. So let's go to Narosh instead of Prycon or Dagon or... Isis Eternal is probably the end game there, so let's, go, let's head to Narosh. Hey, Firetron, how you doing? Good to see ya. Oh, look at that, everybody's having a little meal! A little meal around this huge-ass, like, traditional, not sci-fi table. Pretty fun. Pretty fun. Okay, uh, tax cause, bleeding, crit damage, blah 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 blah. Uh, yeah, let's do that. We've got five points to use. I guess we've been kind of working on, uh... Budget on solo here. I like his damage doing bleeding, right? Let's, let's do that. Excellent. Um, and then we don't need to heal or anything. We're in between things. Uh, health defense plus 15%. That seems pretty good. Um, what else do we have? Oh, oh well, actually no. Both of those are two first, right? So yeah, health defense plus 15. Start working our healer into the mix here. And then, uh... Attack Straining Shields is pretty good, too. Um... Let's do the, the back and forth with them. They're nearly maxed out on relationships, so I guess my... My dig at like, oh, 100 relationship points, what the fuck? It, like, that fills up pretty quick, I guess. Um, and we're good to go here, so let's, uh, let's leave our zero points on the table. <laughs> Yet again. And move on. And, and do some battles or some story or whatever, whatever's next here. I suppose we did just have a big battle at the end of last time, so I imagine we're, we're due for some narrative, some exposition. Here we go. As predicted. Alright. Probably a, a different style of, of folks here. Ooh, wow. A lot of health. Level 6. Rancid shit. I mean, Rance Shinte. <laughs> Alright. Um, regenerates health every round. That's not good. He's got more armor, more shields. Any more shields. He's only got 25 shields. It's not a lot of shields. And he does extra damage, that's not good. Uh, strong against combos and light attacks, but he's weak against counters and antimatter. I guess we haven't seen a lot of like the quote-unquote elemental attacks yet, so whatever. Um, got a ton, it's like pulse damage, doesn't like to bleed, who likes to bleed really? Does more damage, strong against combo, pulse, and light. Got fewer shields, I mean he's got kind of a mid-tier dipshit here. He's weak against counters. I don't think we've really done a lot of counters yet, have we? Slightly lower class lieutenant, I suppose. 
Yada 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 yada. Okay, well these dudes will see on the field of battle, I imagine. Which the other Pima, huh? Yeesh, that's a big boy there. 700 shield, 1300 health, 60 armor, my goodness. Okay, well, I'm sure we'll learn about them in due time. Hmm. So this is a this is a turn-based RPG. <laughs> we don't play a lot of turn-based RPGs, but this one seems pretty pretty sick. As soon as we get into a battle, it'll be a little clearer. Uh, Owen and Narosh, archaeological captain of the capital of the Titan Drift. H2 are some important ruins, and for now let's focus on shutting down the next behemoth. Oh right, we gotta defend this thing in the middle, I guess, huh? Gotta get our butts from here over to there. Same deal, blah blah blah, force fields, we've got three days. Each day we can break down three of these little circular barrier things, right? So... Okay. Alright, there's our party. That's gonna be important later. Dead Titans. Des Titans destroyed by their own overweening pride. Oh no, another race that is beset upon by their own hubris. Great Black Hole Microwave event? This will never know. Uh, Titan battles, blah blah blah. Okay, well let's see what we got. We got a, a fairly sizable dude over here. And some equipment. We can use some equipment for our healer, so hopefully that's got some healer equipment. Uh, um... Yeah, these dudes are already a little deep here. Oh, here's one of the... <laughs> I like how this dude's described as a paste eater. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, can I look at... How do I... Oh, there's a thing up there. That's a thing. Rare tech. For equipment, I like that. Uh, heals. Oh, this is a much bigger area. DNA vat, which DNA we use for level ups, right? So let's see. We can go to three different areas here. Well, three consecutive areas in a single day. Um, so if we go one, maybe two up here. Then three to get over here. Oh, get some money. Or we could go the other direction, right? We could go one, we could for this guy get some rare equipment. Uh go to this area here too. Uh, I guess this would be a number three here. And then go over here. That would cover the perimeter a little bit. And then it'd be one up here, two to here, three to big boy here. Oh, really big boy there. Then one, two would cover it. Okay. Well, let's see. I do want equipments, but I do want rare equipments more than common equipments. But I'm a little hesitant to engage this fucker right away. Level five, and we're only, what, level fours? Level threes? A pair of level fours, a level three, and a level two. That's, uh, that's a little troublesome. Or what are the alternatives, though? If we go this way, one, two, three up here. There's an armor station there, which okay. You know what? Fuck it. Let's let's go. Let's go deal with pasty over here. <laughs> let's go deal with this fucker. Let's get into a battle. Tactics. Oh, here we go. It's teaching us about front row, back row, finally. Uh, here, they only start combat, set formation, their position, and formation, and whether they can hit or not be hit by certain attacks. Front line can be hit by any attack. Back line enemies can only be targeted after all enemies in the front row have been eliminated. Oh, I see. Attacks that can target any position can bypass front, back row. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, got it. How do we... Oh, my God. Oh. Oh jeez, there's like fucking... There's five dudes here! Why are there five dudes here? Oh, this could be a problem. Um, okay. And our... Our formation is pretty much our protag as the... As the frontline tank, huh? And everybody else just kind of falling in. Okay, well... Let's see here. Let's take a look at what we're fighting first. Um... Boy, all these... Fucks are level four, huh? 
I may have made a tactical error. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Well, I don't know that we have much choice here, so alright. Uh let's let's see what our healer has. A mind knife? It's pretty rad. Stimulate, it's a support roll, right? Uh attacks a few ten seconds faster and a, an extra quarter to crit damage. And time aura. Reaction does not end the turn. I don't know what does that mean? Speeds up actions by five seconds. Only one aura can be active at a time. And what was the aura they were telling me about earlier? Oh, here. Effects. Speed. Oh, okay. So all of our actions are quote-unquote five seconds faster. Got it. Plus we regen shields. Oh, no. Only our tank regen shields. But everybody else is faster. Oh, and it looks like they are focusing down my healer immediately. Well, that's good tactics on their part. But, uh, uh, <laughs> let's see if we can maybe make that not happen. Uh, all right. We have anything? I think the only celestial smash. Huh? Not bad. That's a twenty-nine hit of twenty-nine, plus the crit bonus of seven and three to armor on everyone. Everybody, that's pretty good. I don't mind that. Uh, this charge is pretty much. Instant effect. Instant AoE. Punches everybody back a little bit. Oh, interesting. Celestial Smash doesn't, uh, doesn't move them back in the timeline there at all. Which is probably fine, because I don't want to waste... Waste that on... Waste one of our two chances on, like, a tiny attack, so... Alright, um... Well... Which one of you fuckers is about to... Oh, no. Um, it's the dude in the back who's uh, gonna attack my frontliner first, huh? Can we do something about that? No, not really. Well, with the exception of... Uh, still, it's still gonna be a late hit. So the dude in the back is gonna have something to say to me regardless, I think. So... God, wow. After one... one round here, my frontliner's gonna be down all her shields. And all of her armor, and take a chunk out of her health. That's... that's rough. And our healer's gonna be dead. <laughs> and the other two are untouched. Um, so, why not just do, like, AoE there. Everybody will be moving back a little bit. Um, well, actually not until my dude attacks, right? So we might want to... God, who are we going to want to hit first? This guy? Let's get him right the fuck out of here. Move him to turn two. Although, what, what is he attacking? 50? Guys attacking with 24, which is whatever. Guys attacking 36. And those are the only three I can target on account of, uh. Uh. It's all attacking my, uh, my healer. That guy, frontline dude, and middle dude. A double strong blast just to murder my healer. Thanks for that. Okay. Well, that kind of informs my uh, attack here then. Let's get him out of turn one. So fuck him. And that's not gonna be turn two, unfortunately. Um, we do have another one now, which I think. Wait, it's only one per... Okay, no, it's Trick Shot that was only once per battle. Blitz we can do, like, forever. Um...
if we move two of them out of turn one here, that's probably the ideal. Can we... No. Oh, these other fuckers are gonna be able to attack. Alright, let's do that. Alright, so let's get him just fucking out of here. He can't attack until next turn now. So that's something. And he's bleeding, I think, so that's good. Um, Alright, and then we have our healer can do something. Oh, I could actually... Maybe make my attacker... My frontline attack faster with that. No, that wouldn't make any difference, because she's already attacking before the other dudes anyways, except for one of them. Um, so we may as well just do a little bit of damage, I guess. Uh, who can we... Oh. Oh, actually, yeah, we can, uh... Well, pushing him back a little bit isn't going to do much. He's still going to be... Attack my front line. I might. Oh, I can't. Okay, he's already being bodied back, I think. We can at least get this guy's shields out of here. He'll attack last. So, boom. Alright, so he's to next turn now. And he's also on fire. Okay. Forty. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Right. Okay. Well, there goes all of my tank shields. That's not good. Uh, we'll do the massive group attack. That'll take down shields across most of them, and also do a radiator, whatever that is. Oh, bonk. Ouch. Oh, and that's gonna do a, a number on my healer, unfortunately. Okay. Boy, I need more than one of these fuckers to die. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, that dude's gonna attack my healer and probably kill, I'd imagine, right? Yeah. So I need to save my healer. Alternatively, I can... Cool. That's not going to get her shields back in time. Ooh. Well, I could defend. Defending would keep her from dying. We'll wait. We'll see if we can... That's like last resort. Okay. Frontline is still preventing me from getting to anywhere. So realistically, what I could do then... Is What's the... is it the frontline dude? Oh, the backline dude is defending their frontline dude. I hate that. I hate that. <laughs> ah, crap. Uh, alright. Um, is he... Yeah, and he's the one attacking our healer. Oh, that fucking sucks. Well, we're gonna have to blast through him then. And I am gonna need shields back on my frontliner, I think. Yeah, otherwise she's gonna take a massive hit. Okay, so let's get shields back on our person here. Um, let's try to myrtleize the top one there. That's not gonna do it. That's not gonna be enough. Yeah, unfortunately I can't get him out of this round. Could break him out of this round. Dude, just a lighter attack. Get this guy out at least, right? Now, he's delayed until next round. And also bleeding. Robots can bleed somehow, and I think no matter what I do here... Well, I'd have to defend. There's no other way to save my healer. Is 
because the, the one that's about to murder her is the one that of their line that's going first. Okay, I guess I have to be... I have to defend here. I've got no choice. Oh, God. <laughs> Alright, got shields back on our front runner. In time to absorb that blast and some of that one. Yikes. Ah. Ah. Boy, this is now a very big problem. <laughs> I don't think I have much of a choice, though. Hmm. Well. Okay. It's the okay. It's the frontliner there, or the 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 really back dude is about to beat the shit out of my frontliner. Can I do something about that? I still can't target him with any of my delaying stuff. Oh, with the exception of this, I guess. But I can only use it once. I feel like using it on the back, dude. Like, probably the weakest of the... Well, he's not the weakest, but... It's definitely a problem. Uh, I don't want to do that just yet, though. Okay, what else do we have? Do another group attack. That's not gonna bop anybody back. How about just this charge will move things back a little bit, but not much. And I really need shields on my frontliner, honestly. It's gonna be too late. It's gonna be too late to save her from uh, getting a stuffing beat out of her. the best I can hope for is probably delaying one of these dudes attacks and I might be able to get one of them off the field permanently maybe I can get this guy off the field permanently oh my uh, budget Han Solo is gonna take a big hit here too Oh dear. Okay. Can we get. Oh, he's still not even gonna die! Oh, the shithead. Well, if I did that, and then I did maybe this? No, that's not enough. I need to do. I need to do all of that, and he's still not gonna die, unless he, like, eats it from burning or something. But I really need the shields. <laughs> ah, um, okay. I think even defend. Well, is anybody attacking my healer this round? No, they have they have shifted targets, so my healer is free to free to do a thing here. I do that? What if I try to maybe move the midline back a little bit and then use this to push him back even more because that'll move him to next turn. Uh, this might do it. Because this one goes right away. Okay, let's do that. That moves everybody back a little bit. It lets all the rest of our folks do the work here. Oh, bam. Shit. Okay, that one's pushed back the next turn. 
frontliner gets to attack. Ah, ouch. Oh, big, big hit. Uh, but she's still kicking. That's the important bit. Oh, oof. Oh no. Okay, there's a big hit to our budget Han Solo. Any of them die from that? No, none of them die from that. Ah. Okay, it looks like none of our folks are gonna die this round, but let's make that forever a thing. Um, okay, now we can do some fun things. curious about is if we do okay who's the who's the one targeting our budget on solo that guy oh of course the dude in the middle with the most shit on him uh is the one i need to push back what i could do then is trick shot the fucker or is it this guy no it's that guy trick shot him get him off of this round and then work the rest of the problems the way it is. I think that's probably the, the good idea there. All right, so that's fine. He is no longer an issue this this turn. Um, God, I really want this fucker to this frontline fucker needs to go away. I don't know how much I'm going to be doing to him. Oh, what I could do is anybody... Nobody's targeting my healer again. That's good. I could, in theory... So how much... He's got 13. And I'm doing 17. Uh... It should... You're fully through, so he should be toast. But I'm curious why it's not showing up my, uh... The kill shot thing. Is he strong against... Not strong against light attacks. Oh, he's being guarded, that's why. Oh, this fucker. Who's he being guarded by? This dipshit? Yeah, that's not good. Can we do something about that? I already wasted my stun attack from Budget on Solo, though. Alright, can we do... No way I can get rid of their backline defender, unfortunately. Alright, so whoever he's firing on, they're gonna take one on the chin. Oh, my frontliner. Okay, great. Uh, okay, well, then we can work on just beating the shit out of everything else, I think. We do just the giant AoE, just for Grinzies, right? And then... God, I don't really have anything better. That's not quite enough to... Is he on fire? He is not on fire, unfortunately. But I think our... Our spiritual robot dude, does he do fire damage? No. Does fire damage? Oh, my uh, my frontliner does fire damage. You know what? Yeah, that's good then. So let's do that, and then we'll do. Uh, boy, I need to do some shields probably on our frontliner to keep her from getting even more bopped here. do that, and then we can use our healer to probably kill shot, finally. Alright. Fucking not quite toast there, but there. Toast there. Eat shit. There we go. One kill. <laughs> Shields back on our frontliner. Just in time to avoid that, or to absorb that, rather, and then to take the hit on the chin there. Okay, but burned to death, so that's good. All right, looking good there. 
Still don't have access to that backline dipshit, though. It's not the way that I want it to be, so let's see. Gotta work that one down first. Not like either way, who's he going after here? Is it my frontliner taking all the hits? Yeah. Yeesh. But, I could get the shields on just in time. Avoid her taking another hit. So let's queue that up. Um, take him back another round? Or maybe just fucking focus him down and get him off the field. And then... Okay, that's not gonna be the hit there. So there's a kill shot there. Can we get... Okay, we can do... Like a very tiny amount of damage. With our healer. So let's do... Uh... That. And then I guess we'll just get this fucker off the field. There he goes. And then there were two. <laughs> Get our shields back up on our frontliner. Just in time to absorb the hit. And then one more hit there. Ouch. <laughs> Fuck. Alright, now it's four on two. Numbers are in our favor, finally. Um, okay, they're targeting my healer again. Looks like we're gonna have to do some some big things. Ah, oh, that dude's getting defended again. I hate it. Okay, what if we... Okay, but they're only targeting my healer, so that gives me an opportunity to... Shield up. That will... Then allow her to defend. Which should still be fine, right? She'll survive. Oh, she'll survive, but at what cost? Um, so then I really just need to focus down. I'm not going to be able to push him out. So I may as well just do a fucking huge big attack. Get most of that asshole shield's gone. So either way, it's gonna go after that guy. Of course, I can't really do much else with that, so we may as well just do everything we can here. Shield up on our healer. Big ass attack there. And he's on fire. Um, oh god. Shield's gonna take most of the hit. Alright. Oof. I think everybody's gonna live, but they're gonna be beat to hell. <laughs> Two of the four are gonna be beat to hell. gonna do probably that. Oh, whoops. That's an instant. Oops, I should have thought about that a little bit more. Oh, well. We're gonna do that. <laughs> and then we're gonna do uh, pretty big-ish attack. Well, not a big-ish attack. Another instant attack, I guess. That moves him to the next round. And now we've got to push this fucker back by... 20 seconds, which we're gonna do here. Can we do a bi an even bigger one, though? I think we would still get the attack here. 
Oh, that only pushes back by 20, though. Oh, but we could do this first. And then do the big boy attack. Which will push him in the next turn. And do a lot of damage. There we go. Bonk. Okay. There we go. Good. And beyond fire. <laughs> okay. Now... Boy, we are just, we are hanging in there. Okay. He's not guarding his shithead friend again, so that's fun. Oh, but he's going, like, immediately. Uh. We're gonna need to push him back. Give ourselves some time to work. So we'll think about that. Um, if we, we do that, though. Moves back to about middle. It's not going to give us enough time to shield up our front runner. Ooh, the alternative is hold on a second. Do we need to shield up our front runner? Can we just murder him outright? Let's uh, beef up our front, alright? And now. What's going to do a goodly amount to at least take the shield out, right? Although, hmm, that should be moving him back 55, but it's not. Probably because it's a light attack. Is he strong against light attacks? Oh, no. Curious why that's not gonna come back as much as it says it should. I guess we need to move it back regardless, so let's just have him do that. Um, we still have our. Okay, now we can move him back even further. That. Our shields are completely gone. Now oh, the real question is, do I... Okay, there's... We're gonna have a kill shot either way. Who's gonna do more damage? 51 versus... Oh, 90. Yeah, okay. Well, that's a pretty... Pretty easy choice to make, honestly. So then, at least she won't take any more damage against her health. Alright. Let's get that guy out of here. And then... Oh, I suppose we can... A little bit of chip damage on uh, this fucker anyways, so... Alright, get him off the field, fuck you! It's like two kills for our healer. <laughs> okay. And he burned to death anyways, so there we go. Woo! Oh, that was rough! But we got a lot of DNA out of it, so level ups all the way around, I think. Well, mostly for our healer, to get her above level two. My goodness, that was, that was kind of a rough fight. <laughs> kind of a rough fight, but hey, we, we survived, everybody lived. I mean, Lieutenant Paste Eater obviously did not live, but that was the point. Oh, plus we get some rare equipments. What do we get? Oh, cool. We can give a gauntlet to our, well, healer once we level her up. Oh, I'm tempted to get a better S-word, though. Or whatever this is. I don't know what that is. Oh, that's more health. Oh, but nobody can equip it, because that's for level 6s and above. Oh, boy. Uh, I kind of need something on my healer. <laughs> I mean, it's not defense, but it's, uh, it's something. Uh Yeah, I guess we'll grab it. Um and we gotta do some level ups. 
Okay, our healer needs to be minimum level 3. Right? Which, I don't know why I'm calling her a healer. She doesn't have something that can, uh... Grant health. <laughs> Does she? Actually, hold on a second. Where's my, uh... Where can I look at their stuff here? Um... Shield regen? More defense? No, where's like the actual health bits though? I guess she's a healer like in the in the be in between times, in the campouts. That's about it. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> um, okay, we need to we'll probably give her another level though. 16. She needs more health, like, desperately. Because what, what would she get? She would get... Peace, which is, uh... Oh, it's an aura effect, so we would get our speed, huh? Oh, boy. Alright, um... Oh, oh, here's our formation. There we go. You know what? It's probably fine to have our... Just one in the front. She stood up pretty well against that 5-on-4 situation. No armor left, of course. Um, okay, let's... Can I now equip the thing? There it is. Okay, get that up. She's doing more damage with her mind knife, I guess. It's important that... Um... God. Only the plus 12 to health is a bit of a problem, but I kind of need her to not die. <laughs> I don't need, I don't want anybody to die, but I need her to not die in particular. Okay. Seems fine. Um, oh, there's a oh, there's a Healy bit over there. And also uh, another it's another fight. Looks like a slightly lesser fight than the one we just got done with. There's also a level 4 drone there, too. Like, I I kind of need the heals. We're probably going to have to take the risk on this fight. And then take the heals and hope that everybody lives. Um, but alright, so if, if we do that, let me open this up. Uh, number 3 would be to over here. Oof. Which... This area doesn't really have anything, does it? All it does is unlock more fights. Uh, alternatively, we could go this way. Uh, getting armor back would be good, too. That would lead us up here, which is another fight. I mean, I guess it, it's fights all the way around, right? There's no just area we can go to where we're not doing a fight, and then we're getting free shit, right? So, I we may as well just go this way. Let's go this way. At least get the heal. Oh, it's only four like low level dipshits. Lowish level dipshits. And they're all going after my front runner. Which we can probably do something about. We can maybe just myrtleize one of them? Because what's the hit? What's the hit that's gonna happen on my dude there? He's gonna take a little bit of health damage, not much. Looks like they're all pretty much doing the same thing. If, I, if I'm gonna myrtleize one of them, it's gonna be this one. Because that's the oh, that's the dude going after my other dude. Uh, well, we could. could probably get. Oh, except that's not moving anybody back. We could do, like, the light AoE, move that guy off the field, and then myrtleize one of the frontliners, and save everybody, probably. How much does this guy go back? I don't think that's gonna be enough.
But all right. Um, let's do. What is this? Oh, it's defense. Which you know, not a bad idea. Oh, I see. We can change the aura to uh, Regent Shield, which might actually be better. Um, so what does that do? Six shield per round? It's not that much. What's, uh, what's our... Yeah, that's not gonna do much on its own, really. But it does push all three of those fucks back. And it would probably push this fucker entirely back. Which is more or less equivalent to myrtleizing one of them. So let's get that queued up. Uh, one of them's gonna get pushed back, regardless of what we do, I think. And then we can do... Oh yeah, let's just get that fucker out of there entirely, more or less. We can also do it this way. That would do more... That uh, would do direct health damage, right? Because it bypasses shields and armor. We'll, we'll think about it. Probably be more comfortable just blasting them all together. And then we've just got our healer to attack. Okay. Uh. Well, one of these fuckers is already off the timeline, right? I think. One of the ones that's attacking my frontliner, so. about to be anyways. Um, so yeah, I guess we just work them down. Work them down one at a time. Okay, yeah, so that guy's moving to, to next week here, and he's on fire, which is great. That guy's also moving to next week. Frontliner will take a bop there, that's fine. And a second bop. A little bit of health damage, which I... Is fine. We're gonna get a heals after this anyways. <clears throat> okay, now would be the time to, uh... Take this fucker off the field. Or off of this turn, rather, because he's going first. I don't like that. I don't... Well, unless we can do something that will straight up murder him immediately, and it's... I don't think so. Everything all kind of takes some time to do. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Well, that takes fury, huh? I don't like that. But alright, let's just make him not an issue. <laughs> make him not a problem, he's gonna move to next turn. Now we really just need to get ourselves to not die. <clears throat> so what are these doing? Oh man, a front runner is taking a big ass beating here. I don't like that. Ooh. That'll move some of them back, but it's not going to solve any problems. Well, let me queue this up. I can always go back. Okay, that solves an problem. <laughs> Will it stop our front runner from dying now. Could always defend. Which 
will stop her from dying for sure. But we're taking one of them out of the running the way it is. The alternative is to give her some shields to not die. I guess it's a it's enough for her to not die. <laughs> because we're gonna get a heal after this fight anyways. We almost have to. Okay, so let's do, uh, who's the one in front there? That's the one. That's the one I want to murder, I think. Although there's two of them attacking her, isn't there? 44 and... 89 off Adolfa. So what does she have left? 99? Okay, that's not going to be enough. So that guy's going to die, and a whole bunch of other things are going to take a hit. But then I need her to defend, probably? Like, that's the only way she survives this, is by defending. This other dude, uh, which dude is attacking my budget Han Solo here? None of them are. That's interesting. So I really need to myrtleize. Oh, one of the other two that I can't target right now. Oh, uh, that's unfortunate. All right, let's back this up a little bit. Except he's already stunned until next turn. Right? No, except. Wait, which one of these fuckers is. That guy. Okay, that's the guy targeting my budget on solo. I don't really care as much about that one, I guess. I'd rather get him off the field, but I'm not that concerned about it. Because he'll take a bot, and then the dude who attacked him will die, uh, and then we can get rid of that one? Probably. And then our front runner can... Well, she can't target the middle dude even after he dies, so we might just need to defend with her. so that she doesn't die. And then take the other two out next round. Yeah, I think that's what's gonna have to happen. All right, so that's fine. Budget Han Solo takes a tap, that's fine. And big group hit, which should I hope murder one of them. Okay, good. And then... Oh boy. Front runner takes a tap. That's fine. Ouch, ouch, ouch. She's still standing. <laughs> That's fine. Also... Oh dear. Okay, now we need to do some things. So we can get that guy just straight up off the field. Seems like a good idea. Just get him out. Um, if I give my front runner shields, she'll survive for sure. Which is also good. Ooh. One of them's targeting my healer. She'll survive, though. So, all right, just so I don't fuck this up, let's make sure the shields are queued up, and then, uh, oh wait, why can I only target that one? Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, who is, 
Okay, let's cancel that. Let's get the shields queued up for sure. Um... Or would it be more effective to... Do another big boom slam here. AoE attack on everything. And just ensure one of my dudes, or one of those dudes, gets hit. <laughs> so if we queue that up, let's ensure that this guy goes the fuck away. Right? If I defend with her again, she'll just barely survive. Ugh. Because what is he's doing? 71 and she's got not enough to survive that. I, God, I don't like that. <laughs> uh... Okay, I'm going to need her to defend again. At least that'll guarantee she survives this round. And then we can work down uh, this fucker here. Yeah, that's going to have to be it. Alright, so he should be toast. He's out. Fuck off. That guy's gonna take a little stab to the chestal region, I guess. Nice AoE there. Good armor break. Excellent. And whatever that means, I don't know. Take a point blank bop there, but she'll live. And then our healer will take a big hit, but she'll live. Okay, and now we need to we need to make this work immediately. <laughs> All right, let's get a kill there. Um, looks like we're gonna get a kill regardless of what we do here. So boom, bam, boom, bam. Front runners, fucking toast. And then it's just the dude in the back, which kill and kill. Who's gonna get the kill here? Our healer. Oh no, our front runner is gonna get the kill. Very good. <laughs> Woo! All right. Everybody lives. We need this heal. <laughs> All right. Everybody's back on their feet. The only thing really we're missing is our armor. Um, plus, we can level up. So let's... Uh, who, who gets the level up? Uh, I wish our level ups included... Uh, additional shields. Mm. What do we got? 34? Okay. Only one person's getting a level. I guess our... I guess our budget Han Solo, just to keep everything balanced, yeah. Yeah, they better. Okay. And the choice as to which one to do. Oh, oh. All these fights from here on out are going to be a little bit stodgy. Ah. Uh, I would love this epic equips up there. And that rare tech there, but jeez, these two fights back to back I think would be ruinous. But going this direction, that's that's the only option we have. I think I might be better off coming back this way. Maybe taking this fight here. It's a much lower level fight, but that'll be the end of the first day, and then it'll be one, two to fight this big fucker here. And three to get in here. And we'll be able to spend the final day however we will. Oh, that seems like a better idea. I don't like it. I think that's what we're gonna have to do. Let's take this fight here. We'll get some extra money. Okay, so four on three, so... 
odds in our favor. Um, who shoot what here? They're all going against my front runner. Cue that up. And we bop this fucker into next week a little bit. This guy just out out of the way immediately, but okay. Extra action this round. Ooh, that's actually pretty good. You know what? Why don't we do that? Give our our front big beefy one another action. Is that a good idea? I think that's a good idea. Yeah. Doing 26, 70, and 45 for us. Alternatively, I take this guy out of the running entirely, or at least out of this turn, right? That's probably more important at this point, right? Because he's going to do 70. We just healed up, and I don't want to lose that again. All right, so let's get him to fuck off for a round. Um, now we can focus down... Oh, nice, that's going to be a kill shot, I guess. So that one's off the table entirely. You know what? Yeah, let's do that. Yep. Get out of here, fucko. Here we action there, his shields are gone. That dude's shields are almost completely gone as well. Moderate hit to our front runner, that's fine, but we should find a favorable timeline on this one. Yeah, there we go, no problems. Okay, we wanted to do shields up on our front runner just to ensure that nothing is gonna assail her, really. Get this guy pushed back. And then draw oh, that'll break him off the timeline entirely. And then we've got budget on solo to finish the job or just uh, push him back another round. And then we finish the job on the next round. like a good idea. Alright, everybody's back to full shield. Oh, that's gonna be... Do you have people fast enough to do this? Yeah, I think so. Either way, we are... Are we gonna get double kill here? Oh, shit. Oh, no. We'll get one kill. That's good, too, actually. <laughs> and that pushes, like, that fucker back anyway. So, all right, so who gets the kill? Uh, Budget Han Solo gets the kill. All right. Good job, buddy. You did it. All right, that was a good fight. That was a good fight. No, uh, no bops taken. Plus, we get all of our armor back for somebody. Uh... Probably our frontliner, yeah? She's the only one with, well, besides her and Budget on Solo, but yeah, there we go. Oh, she gets the extra armor. Yeah, there we go. That works, too. A little bit of extra DNA, and then uh, let's do a level up to... Uh, hmm. Hot Revenge. Oh, damage 33% for two battle. Damage and defense up for two battles. That's pretty good. Attack speed, two battles. 
and shield and armor piercing for two battles. Uh, I like that, yeah. Yeah, congratulations, you get the level up healer. Ostensible healer, who has not healed anything, but, you know, tries your best. Okay, well, let's get our extra monies and, and what have you. Looks like we got a couple things. The extra cash, I guess. Most important bit is everybody survived. Everybody's back to full health and full armor. I probably could have rolled the dice and not taken the full heal after that second battle, but you know, too late. Too late. I wasn't sure what the third battle was going to throw at us, so you know what? I'm probably glad I played it safe. All right, let's pop a squad around the old fire and see what we can do here. Um, we just got a new thing for... Oh, what do you mean no valid target? Why not? Oh, these have restrictions on it. You gotta be friendly with somebody first before uh, you can use some of these. Fucking boo! Oh, I hate it. <laughs> Damn it, relationships are complicated. Hmm. Alright, well, that kind of stinks. That would have informed my level up choice if I had known about that. Okay. Ooh, max shields. Uh, yeah, actually. More shields to my front runner. That sounds good. Um, and then... Attacks causing... Attacks causing bleeding has been doing a lot of... A lot of work. So I don't feel bad about using it every time. So, yoink! And then, Budget Han Solo and Front Runner are, uh... Are, uh, are really close. Very good friends. <laughs> Very good friends, in fact. Um, but also we get more health and more time delay on our attacks. So that's good. That's great. Good job. Um, we got two action points left. Let's see. Oh, cool. Right, because this was free. These uh, memory bits are free. Like, remember the time we murdered that guy? Yeah, I sure do. Um... <laughs> Okay, what do we got? We got two action points left. Um, tax drain, ten shields. You know what? Let's put that on our spiritual robot dude. Here. Or steals ten shields, I guess. You yeah, know, that's even better. Um, and everybody's all good. We don't need to use the food. We could, but I don't think things have been doing burning, so we're we're good. All good. Okay, dawn of the second day, 48 hours remain. Um, I guess we're kind of locked into this path now, because that one's all blocked up. We could go over here. Some other equips. That would then be one, two to a slightly harder fight, and then three up here. Which would leave us to then one, two, and then our choice. Alternatively, we do uh, go directly to this one. One, two, and then three. Get into the center. And then we're at our liberty for day three, I suppose. <sighs> I think we're only going to be able to do one of these tough-ass fights. Probably going to skip this one. I don't think we're going to be able to face a level six in whatever dipshits he's got with him. All right. Let's see, this will be a not a terribly difficult fight, probably. Looks like there's nothing extra in this area, anyways. Okay, the rare equips is up there. There's nothing extra there either. 
I don't think there's any other heals, right? We're gonna have to rely on now our campouts to do the healing. Ugh. Well, alright. Let's start with this one. Oh, okay. It's four on three. And four on threes, I think we can take. Oh, okay. I don't like you getting that. That was like you get an opening attack. That's fucking stupid. All right. Uh, it's like that hardly affected us, really. If we could, then... Focus down one of them, and then we'd be at our leisure to deal with the rest. Wait, which, which is the one that's doing the, the frontline attack there? Definitely not any of the ones I can hit. Oh, this one here. Okay. You know what? We could do that, and then we could do a uh, big ol' AoE. And then... Break that one into next week, and... Oh, not quite myrtleize that one, huh? None of the rest of these are... God, why can't I target these other fucking assholes? Alright, let's reset that for a moment. Okay, that one I think for sure I want to push back. I could push him back even further, but that would only be the second one. Okay, we could push this guy back entirely. That would reduce the pressure on our frontliner. Wouldn't be dead, necessarily, but it would push him to next turn, which would be fine. And then really the last bit is our, probably our big boom slam AoE here. Alright, so let's push him back, get him shields down, that's good, and into next week. And do some not bad damage. And then big boom AoE slam there. Armor's gone. Radiated, and I think he's bleeding too, but hard to really tell. Okay, he's he's toast entirely. Good. That's even better. Alright. Now. Uh everybody's doing okay here. Break either of these into next week, really. Yeah, I mean, essentially free. Essentially free, and then I think we might even be able to just mop them all up. Mop both of them up this turn. Because AoE will take care of the dude in the back. And uh, Mind Knife plus AoE will take care of the dude in the front. So uh, our spiritual robot dude is going to get a double kill here, I think. Bonk. Don't kill. Nice. All right. Excellent. Blah blah blah. Flavor text. I, I guess the, like the Eternalists. From what I pulled from this, the Eternalists are like the the non-reality hopping beings, entities, whatever that are supporting the reality hopping beings or entities. So that's a that's probably our our enemy force at this point. Um, okay, so now we've got our choice. We're going to be going in full strength against that fucko. Or... We could try to take on this one. First. Which, probably not ideal. We should, we should take on the, the big bad. The, the, the bigger bad, uh, whilst we're at full strength. And then worry about the others later. Oh, we can level up again. Okay, uh, who gets, well, only... 
Only our uh, spiritual robot dude gets the level up here, and he's not really getting much either. 11 to health, and that's it. Maybe I wait. Maybe I wait so we can level up somebody with a bit more oomph behind him. Yeah. Um, do we know anything else about this big bad here? No, none of my buttons are telling me more about him. I should have read... Oh, wait, maybe I can do that, actually. Uh, Imperium, right? Yeah. Um, this is, I think, this fucko. Pulse damage, enraged when bleeding. Uh, that's a problem, I think, because, uh... One of our attacks does... I think our spiritual robot dude's got bleedy attacks now. Uh, his attacks do extra damage, but he's only 116, 240... Well, only 116, 242. Um, defends against pulse and light attacks, and against combo attacks. He's got supposedly lower shields, um, and we have no counters to speak of, so that's whatever. Uh, okay. I don't know if that knowledge helps us. Probably not. But if we're gonna fight him, we should fight him now. While we're at full strength. Let's do it. What's the worst that could happen? Ah, oh, I was afraid that he was gonna have some dipshits accompanying him. Oh, okay. So which one of you is the, the top dipshit here? You, huh? Okay, of course, it's the dude in the back. Ugh. Is he guarding that fucko? No, because he's, he's set up to... beat up our front runner there. Oh, that's doing an attack against everybody. Great. Glad to see that they've got AoEs, too. <sighs> Alright. Well, oh, that guy doesn't have shields, though. He's got to have a lot of health, though, right? To make up for it. Oh, yeah, 568. Son of a bitch. Alright. Well, the good news is, I guess... We could... Ah, oh, he's resistant against light attacks, but he should be stunned anyways, right? So we could take him off this turn. Just absolutely remove him. No props. Yeesh. But that, we can only do that one one time in this battle, so... Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> uh. At this point, maybe we're better off... ...trading in a shield regen, huh? Trading in for a shield regen, rather. Um... Because we don't need to outspeed them right now. So let's go ahead and change up to shield regen. Oh, and we can trade trade back pretty much at any time. That's good. Um, also really help out our front runner there. We wanted to... And what does that take? That takes 20 as well. Well, I mean, the good news is we've got a lot of fury to work with. That's our little, like, little special points. But I kind of want to have as much fury as we possibly can going into the actual big bad battle, which won't be for a few battles yet, so we've got some time. Um, oh, interesting. What does that do? Explosives. What does the explosives do? 51. That's 51 AoE plus... Uh, Plus the 38 crit, so... I don't mind that. Who gets pissed off if they're bleeding? Is it this guy? Yeah. 
Hmm. Maybe we wait on that. Okay. Uh. Okay, we can push that guy into next week. What's this dude's deal? He's gonna do 110 against my front runner. I don't like that. Um, but we can probably mitigate that with uh this. It says 15% defense versus 110. How many shields does she have? She has 90 shields. So if I do that, Okay, our little preview thing doesn't account for this, I don't think. Um, I think I'm gonna do that, since our front runner is taking the brunt of the damage here. Let's get you some defense. Um, we could do a combo attack. What is that? Wow, 102. Oh, and it stuns. Uh... Tempting. Honestly, that's tempting. Um, would that... Uh, that would probably absorb the... Uh, that'd probably prevent me from doing trick shot on this bucko, though. So maybe we don't... Maybe we don't do that. We save that for maybe next turn. Except... Okay, that... It shows that he'd still be stunned. I'm worried that his resistance to light attacks is gonna prevent him from being stunned, but it's it's probably just a damage resist and not a status resist, right? I guess we'll find out. Fuck you. Get stunned, dipshit. Okay. Did still stun him, so he's out for this turn. I like that. Then, we could, uh... Oh, our healer already went. She's doing the the damage or the defense buff on our front line, which is good because now she's not taking any health or armor damage. So at this point, our options are to maybe just AOE and try to whittle away his his front guards there. Or we burn the rest of my fury. Did I? I trick shot it, right? But we've still got enough fury for the combo next round to then stun the back row dipshit again. Um, so let's just do that, and we'll do, I guess, AoE. And chip away at him. Yeah, that seems like a good plan. Alright, so he's stunned in the next week. And on fire. Um... A little big AoE there. Shields down on that fucko. Front runner will take that hit on the chin. That's fine. And then we've got some help, uh, some shield regen, which is great. And now, if we really wanted to push this fucko into next week yet again, uh, we could do that. Which, if we do that, I think that saves us from taking a pretty big hit, right? Because he's up to 85% now, or 85 damage on that one. And really, we've just got this fucko doing a ground pound, which is nothing. I hate this guy got his shields back. What a fuck ass. All right. Uh, all right, we'll think about that. Let's see what we can do with our other folks here. That'll eliminate shields for dipshit A there. I still can't target. Like, why can I not target the dude on the bottom there? He seems to be, like, in the front line. He is not... Not doing it like that. All right, that's fine. Um, you know what? I'm gonna do this then. Let's do. Let's get back row dipshit out of here again. Um, 
That'll do a fair amount of damage too, right? Eh, sort of. Oh, he's stunned. So he's, he's off the field for turn two here. Um, we could push this guy back a little bit and ensure crit from this, yeah? Which at that point will be light shield damage across everybody, that's fine. Okay, good. Only unfortunate bit about this is now we have no, ouch, we have no means of, uh, stunning the back row dipshit again, so, uh... <laughs> uh, this is gonna be a small issue now. Um, okay, well... Oh, he's going right away, huh? Yeah, that's not good. Can we push him back somehow? Not with that. Yeah, he is acting first. I do not like that. Because that's going to stun my front runner and do some damage. I don't like that at all. <sighs> okay, I have much of a choice here. See, I burned my two stun attacks right away. That was dumb. And this won't push him back on account of Actually, I don't, I don't know, on account of what. That, that should push him back, but it's not going to. Oh, only if it's a crit, which it's not going to be. That's dumb. Okay. And none of his other attacks go first. Ah! I think I did a fuck up here. Well, I mean, I guess the good news is he's not... Back row dipshit is not attacking me. But the two front row dipshits are. I suppose what I could do then, knowing that I'm about to get bopped on the nose, I could defend. Reduce the amount of damage I'm about to take since I'm not going to be able to move this turn anyways, right? That seems to be a good idea, and then we can do just whatever. Charge up a few attacks. Uh... Oh, their front line is going to absorb this. I hate it. The exception of this... So that's not gonna... Is this guy... Okay. So he's technically not taking an action this this turn. That's why he can't be pushed into the next turn. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we've got... I guess my other option is then to also boost... Boost defense. Wouldn't be a bad idea, actually, at this point. Defend and boost defense to prevent taking any additional armor or or health damage, I guess, right? Which, eh, it seem like it's gonna do anything? We'll see. Maybe it doesn't just land like that. Who knows? Alright. So bonk. It still did health damage. Okay, it must have penetrated or something. I don't know who who's that strong blast going against my spiritual robot dude, right? Okay, that's fine. I think he, sh he should be able to take that on the nose a little bit. Uh... Okay, I am... Uh... Not liking this particularly much, but 
We could probably get a kill shot on this fucko if I... Oh, he's not getting pushed back. Oh, it's the dude in front that's being a problem, huh? Ah, oh, the is so pissed still... Blocking everything. Oh, that's gonna be a big hit against my front runner. I don't like that. But I don't have much of a choice here. Gotta get rid of that fucker. In the back. But I don't... Is... Which one is he? <laughs> Which one is he? Okay, he's the, he's the dude acting first. I don't like that. Okay. Uh, can we do literally anything about that? Don't think so. He's going to resist the light attack. And I can't target him anyway, so that's fun. What happens if I take our speed ups here? Will that help me? I still can't target him. Okay, that'll do it. The extra speed actually helps me here, because now this is an instant attack. Dipshit in the back dies. So that saves our front runner from 53, which is not enough necessarily, but I want him off the field anyway, so fuck you. Get the kill. And now we just need to work with these two. Um, which one of you is doing more? 67? 51. Okay. Uh, can we push one of you into next week? We can almost push this fucker into next week. Probably do it with, like, two attacks on him. Uh, so that plus that will break him into next week. If I instead do this, that'll reduce the amount of damage she takes, right? So if I use that plus maybe a defend she'll take far less damage, right? Unless this dude's got a penetrating attack. Doesn't. But I do need to do double attack on this guy to get him into next week anyway, so we'll take the, the hit to armor and partial health bop just to make sure that we don't lose even more. So get that fucker off this turn. He's gone. Take the hit here, whatever. Um, and now we've got pretty much one round to to make this work. So let's see what we can do here. Oh, that guy is not going to be pushed back any further, huh? So we either focus him down or or defend my uh, front runner here. Okay, that'll prevent most bad things. Now our option is to... God, I still can't... Can't delay this guy back. I don't have enough. I can't target... That guy's not going to be pushed back any further, and I can't target... This dude who's just barely, apparently, in the fu fucking back row. Um... Alright, probably go back to shield regen then, since we don't need to outspeed any of these guys, really. But I... realistically... The only way I'm gonna be able to delay... ostensible back row dipshit there is to do that. And to do that. Oh, not even that. That's not even gonna do it. 
That's not gonna be enough to get him into next week there. Okay. That stinks. So alternative then is to... Uh, well, wait. Can I? Oh, I can't target him. I could target this guy. 67 versus 51. How many shields do we got here? Five. Alright. Uh, I still need to push him back a little bit, though. Otherwise, we're going to be in bad shape. So I need to do... Probably shields here. I need to pu push that guy back. And then I need to try to myrtleize this guy, which is not going to happen. Oh, wait, I can push this one entirely back. If I do that, then our shields are saved. Well, the extra shield boost will save us regardless of what happens here. So, yeah, let's do that. Oh, wait. Uh, it's Sunder. Yeah, there we go. Should be enough to make us survive without any other bombs. Okay. Let's do that. So, bonk. Eat shit. Shoot him one for good measure, you know? And bleed. Then, boom. Push you into next week. And then our shield boost, uh, well, our slash first, I guess? No, our shield boost then. Right before the big hit here. No problem. Alright, slight shield regen for everybody, that's good. Um, now... Okay, he is not... ...taking an action this round, that's good. Problem being that I need to fucking now myrtleize this other one before he is able to do anything. Only got a few... Well, that'll myrtleize him regardless, I think, right? So who are you shooting at? 51 versus... How much shield do I have? 30. Okay. Uh... that, we do that, we do that, is that gonna be a kill shot? No. Fortunately. Instead do the shot there, and then take a brief hit there. What if I give her some defense? It back but <laughs> but instead defend um she's still gonna take a hit huh somehow why need to either push that fucker off the timeline or well I mean the only ones that can attack that fucker is this one right which is not going to happen because it's already, uh... I would need to do that, and I would need to do, like, that. And then also that. Push him back even further. And then do, uh, Sunder, yeah? Oh, which is just going to murder immediately. Okay, that's even better. And then we do that and push him into next week anyways. Okay, that's good. Order of operations, right? Okay. Yeah, it's all worth it, really. It's worth taking the time as long as we don't take a bot for many of these things. Okay, so now this is gonna be... Uh, we have to be quick about this. 
And in order to do that, we need our uh, speed boost here. So let's just do that real quick. Um, and then we can just go bop and bop and I don't know, bop, I guess. Okay, he gets to go immediately. Good job. Um, and then they can all duke it out for who gets the kill shot. Looks like our healer. <laughs> oh, no, sorry. A front runner gets it. Very good. Bam. A big, big fucking loot there. And you know, pretty minimal damage done to us. A little bit of armor damage, a little bit of health damage, too. Um, which is unfortunate, but should be enough. Okay, now we've got big level ups we can do. We can do two big level ups. Uh, probably our frontliner and also, yeah, yeah, whatever, I don't care what I got from that. And this. And our budget on solo. Alright, that's looking real good. Um, was there, like, no, not something we had, had a level requirement on it. I guess not. Just we never bought or picked up one of those, so whatever. Okay. Good. Okay, flavor text there. Oh, plus we get some some stuff. What do we get here? Ooh. Oh, that would be fun, but nobody's level six. And especially not the single dude who can equip it. Damn. Alright, but, uh... Level 5 implant there. Or we could just get some additional armor. Hmm. Armor damage for heavy attacks, or just that for... Uh every attack for more damage versus shields well that's that's pretty good why can't i equip that to hmm. i guess everybody can equip it this uh the little like double chevron up there means that it would be an upgrade for them i suppose yeah oh that's real tempting you know what let's grab it and we'll Organize our stuff accordingly. I think I probably want this. 22% armor damage and 10% damage versus shield is pretty good. And we can put the other thing on the attacks. Like we don't do we have a heavy attack on our spiritual robot dude? Where where can I see his stuff? Uh, here. No, uh, skill tree. Skill tree. Uh, right trigger. Doesn't have a heavy attack, does he? Got an AoE. Yeah, does our... Budget Han Solo have a heavy attack? No. A healer definitely doesn't. Damn. Okay, it's like, only our frontrunner's got the heavy attack. That's the most beneficial one, I guess. But, uh, who else has got, like, good stagger? I guess our robot has got good stagger. We use a lot of AoE attacks with, like, delays and shit, so that's, uh... That's a good one to give him. Yeah. Okay. Alright, and now... Oh, this one's not a... Not a hey barrier bust shit, huh? Okay. So now we've got our option to go back there, or up there. Go back to these other areas, get some extra stuff. What is that? Oh, that's a shield state. You know what? That might not be a bad idea. Oh, but that's gonna take like one, two, th Jesus, a lot of attacks, or a lot of battles to get through. Which if we go back, it would be one. That'll be the end of the second day, and then one, two, three, we just barely get there for end of the third day. 
Oh. Tempting, but probably, uh... Probably not worth it. A lot of battles. We need to, like, stay frosty for the actual big boss. Um, I wouldn't mind maybe taking a couple of these smaller battles just to get more level ups and shit. Like, we could take these three, maybe. Get food there, I guess, just in case we need to heal up. And then, uh... Well, maybe we do this one first. Get some money. Take a little bit of damage on the way in, but that's fine. We get some money, and then we've got uh, one, two, three here. Yeah, or I could try to do this fucker. I'd really like this equipment up here, but I don't know that I want to risk the fight against this guy. Seems like a bad idea. I don't think we're ready for that. I guess we can do that last if we if we think we can take that fight, but not right now. Let's go ahead and take this fight. Okay, this seems not unreasonable. Uh, maybe. <laughs> uh, these are new enemy types I have not seen. What well, we got? A straight up Zambo here? Ugh, great. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Uh, but alright. If we really want to, we can take that one out. That would be a delay there. Decent damage. We don't do anything. Uh, our front runners take blast of everything there. Okay. Actually, what do we got? Okay, there's nothing special there. Pulse damage, I don't know what that means. I guess it's additional shield damage. And then this one is just like, ah, uh, fuck me, I guess. Okay, not much to deal with, so that's fine. Um, we do the immediate attack there. Can anybody else attack that back one? Probably my... Yeah, there we go. So we could get her out of here. <laughs> Pretty much doing the 88. That's a big fucking swing. We get rid of that. 44 we can deal with. 41 we can deal with. So if we do... That, I guess? We need to move the, the front row one back a lot. Like that. That one back, that one back even further, and then we can probably get a kill on this, or at least move that one out of here. So it's not going to be a kill shot on any of them, so I'm going to want to move them all the way back. Let's do that. Move that one into next week. Oh, that one's not getting moved anymore. Shh. Kind of miscalculated that, I think. So we're gonna take the hit there, and then the hit here, I think. Ah, nuts and gum. Whoops. Okay, that's that's fine. We'll, we'll deal. We'll deal. Um, because we've got. Always do this, I guess. Is that gonna. It's gonna stun and do a lot of damage. Which wouldn't be a bad choice, because that I think takes 20 versus 15 in each two turns, or two of my focus's turns here, so maybe we don't. Instead, we do a trick shot, which does. Hardly anything. Hardly any damage at least gets it off the field for this turn. 
That's the only way we're gonna get it off the field for this turn. She's at zero. Okay. Um. Let's see what else we can do regardless here. That's not gonna do hardly any damage. So how much fucking... 69. Nice. Health left. 40 plus 28. Well, that'll be good enough, right? Especially with the crit bonus going on. Okay. Let's do this. Let's do that. Plus the uh, guaranteed stun here. Uh, well, actually, hold on a second. Let's... Back to our shield regen. So I think even with that, we can act quickly enough to make this work. So we do the stun there. Oh, well. Well, actually, why is that it's interesting? Because that'll act right there, right? No problem. I guess I'm worried about this fucker here. I don't think I'm gonna be able to push that other fucker into next week, am I? Well, unless we do that. And let's see. That? That's not gonna be enough. I think I need to stun this one off the face of the earth here, because that 88 is gonna be a big hit. We can't have that happen. So between this and maybe the, the combo attack later. Give us some time to work here. Now the question is gonna be... One, I can get that one off the field entirely. Which might be for the best. Well, hold on a second, let's see what our healers got. Push that one back a little bit. Okay, what if we do that plus that? That'll push that one back entirely. And then that'll be the kill shot there. Perfect. Okay. All right. So that does that. Get that one off the board. Fuck you. Gross. Um. Oh, and that did shield damage. Interesting. I did not catch that. All right. And that should push that fucker into next week. Good. Mm. Now, however, <laughs> yeesh. Um, gotta get that guy out of here. The only way I'm gonna do that is if I probably speed things up again, and then that one plus. That will be a kill shot, um, but return fire is going to be a problem over there, so let's do this to get a stun. Is that still going to return fire, though? Like, why, though? I don't like that. Um, oh, it's going to be, like, a very tiny amount of shield damage. I don't care. Okay, so fuck you get stunned again. Very small counter, which did hardly, well, which actually didn't do anything, come to think of it. Um, and now that leaves... Oh, 
Well, I thought one of these was going to be a kill shot. Am I stupid? Maybe instead I should do... Oh, because the shield distribution thing happened. That's why he's no longer going to get murdered here. Ah. Uh, that annoys me. Hmm. Well, that in mind then, go back to our shield regen. Not gonna be able to not gonna be able to prevent her from taking damage. Ah nuts. Cause I can't push this fucker back any further, and I can't kill him this round either. Ah, that annoys me. Well, with that in mind then, what happens if we do that? We're gonna get a return fire and whatever. And we do that, that's not going to be enough to kill, huh? Well, maybe it might with, uh... I don't know if we're doing burning or bleeding now. Alright, what's our front runner going to take here? Not a uh, slight bop. Probably not enough for me to change up the strat here. The alternative is to do defense buff here to reduce the amount that's going to happen, I guess. And then we'll do just big AoE and we'll take a very small amount of shield damage on return. It's fine. Uh... I don't like it. I don't like it, but it was probably the best we could have hoped for there. Okay. Let's get... Let's get the back fucker out of there for sure. Can we now... do enough damage to this other one to make him go away? We can. Alright, and let's guarantee that they go away. <laughs> Excellent. Alright, kill shot there, good job. This fucker's going down next. Excellent. Alright. Not an unreasonable bounty there. Get enough to level up again. I guess probably our healer. Anything else kind of sitting around here? Mm, well, that. Later, probably. Hmm, okay. Well, then our final three turns is going to be... Probably over this way. Well, if we go this way, we're not going to... Probably not going to fight the, the bigger fish bad there. Oh, well, if that's the case, we're kind of stuck going this direction, I guess. we go this way, take, like, one tiny battle there, a tiny battle there, get some food or whatever, maybe even take this battle? Take this battle first, we can get some equips. Might be better than what we got, who knows? And then we can take these two tiny battles. And be leveled up and ready for the big bad. That seems about as good as we're going to get, probably. Is 
Okay, well, how are we doing health-wise? Not terribly good. But where's our healer? Where's our healer and get her to do some health here? Okay, there's there's the heals. 50%, pretty good. Uh, only one action point burned, but we can do just a quick... Yeah, remember that murder? Yeah, I sure remember that murder. Uh, let's bond over it. Okay, there we go. Um, and then... We'll probably want to do... Uh, attacks cause bleeding and 25% crit. Yeah, we'll do that one. And what, what's the heal? What's that cost? That costs... Oh no, not two. It costs one. Oops. Costs one. I'm not too worried about it, I guess. But I would prefer to have fullish health going into whatever we're gonna go into, so. Extra health damage would be nice as well, so why don't we do. our other ones. Oh, I could have done this. Ah, oh, I should have done that instead. Now too late. Or no, it's not too late, actually. Uh, to that. So then I'll do shield defense as well, which is great. Into that, even though they're already maxed out relationship-wise. Get the heals. Cheaper, I guess. Do like the max shields as well. Only do one of these, so uh, attack speed, huh? Now, give me the max shields. Max shields on our frontliner. Oh, plus we get an extra little bit here. That's a smart toaster. Uh, what, what do we get for our trouble here? Uh, more, more and better bleeding? Oh, we get a combo, too. Oh, that's actually a pretty sick combo. Alright, into that. And we got one point, so we can do... Oh, armor piercing? It's pretty good. That's pretty much the only one we can use, so alright. Uh, armor piercing to... I don't know, I guess we're front runner. <laughs> Why not? Okay. Looks good. Good beef up there. Oh, alright, we got three more things we can do then. So if we go to... Maybe this big beefy one up here first, since we're full of piss and vinegar that we can go take him on. I mean, he's not level 4, it's hardly nothing, right? Uh, oh, we can level up. Who can level up? Oh, our, our robo dude. Um, what does he get? Oh, we could, should have done that prior to the camo. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, no problem. Uh, maybe we wait then, since he only gains 11 health otherwise. Wait to level up for some other things. Hey Richard Digvik, how you doing? See ya. Uh, it's getting kinda late, so we'll do maybe two of these battles, and then we'll call it a night, and leave the last battle and the big bad battle for next time. Um, but I think we will do this one. Get that equipment. Oh, it's four on two. Oh, I like these odds. I like these odds. Oh, I don't like that he scanned my healer there. That's not good. What are we dealing with here? 40, 61. Oh, the big fucker. I don't like that guy. Well, let's see. Uh, nothing special. Oh, he's got regen health? Boo! I hate that. 
But I guess these guys don't look too terrible, and our front runner will absorb the attack without any issue, so... Let's see what we can do. Do we need to outspeed anybody, or can we slam our shield regen on here right away? So big Boom Slam is a good delay. 35 seconds. Our Sunder takes so Why does our Sunder take so long? That's weird. Okay, delay by 16 there. Delay by 25 there. What's the delay? Ten, only 10 on either of those, which is not enough, really. I can get both these fuckos delayed in one. Yeah, like I could do that, and then... Can we attack? Yeah, alright, that's a good idea. This Blitz will take this dude off the board for this turn. Um, I don't need to outspeed him for that. Let's go back to our shield read then. Now we should still be alright, right? If we do a Blitz, he's uh, off the board regardless, right? So fuck you! Get pushed into next turn, dipshit. Alright. Um, and now we just need to worry about the dude in the back. He's about to... Fuck Odon anyways. We could probably just do a... Well, let's do this first. Get him delayed so then our AoE will work here. Do some work here, right? And then our healer. <laughs> we'll push him into the rest of next week. There we go. Should be on fire, too. Good. The trouble is gonna be that he's gonna get an attack regardless next turn, so we're gonna have to play that correctly, I think. Hmm, they are moving fast. Okay. We can delay him once, but that's all we're gonna get. But it looks like our front runner is gonna absorb the attack no matter what. So if we could somehow myrtleize the front runner there. Uh oh, her slash is pretty delayed there. I don't like that. All our attacks are pretty slow. What the fuck? Oh, we could do one of our fancy combo moves, too. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's a fucking EOE? <gasps> that's lovely! Uh... That's fucking lovely. Oh, but it costs Fury, though. Uh, eh, I guess we'll get enough to regen. Hit for later. Do it. I want- that fucking AOE combo? Gimme. Oh, that's so sick. Nice. Alright, well that fucker's gone. <laughs> See you in hell. Uh, can we now... Myrtleize him before he gets an attack? I guess it's not gonna matter. He's gonna... We're gonna do shield damage on our front runner anyway, so we can just... Do both of these and it's fine. So boom. Take 41 there, fucko, and take 71 there. Nice, okay. And he's rattled. I don't know what rattled him. And then we'll just shrug off that shield hit, no problem. And then it's gonna be roll of the dice who gets this kill. Probably our uh Oh not our not our robo spiritual dude. That's alright. Front runner gets the kill. Protag gets the killed. Gets the kill. Get 20 more DNA there, nice. Okay. Excellent fight. Oh, and some free equips. Right, 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 right. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Uh, eh. Damage flurry. I don't think we've got flurry attacks, do we? I do like the uh, armor steel, though. That's pretty sick. You give that to our... Uh, 
our budget Han Solo, I guess. He's the only one with, other one with armor. Anybody who's got a flurry type attack? I don't think so. You like the extra damage for light attacks, though. That's pretty fucking sick. We do a lot of light attacks. Maybe we give that to Budget Han Solo here. Yeah, sure. Do it. Now we can level up somebody serious. Um, maybe our front runner? Oh, we can't. We're three short. Damn. Okay, maybe we wait then. Do the next battle and then we'll do the level up. This battle should be no problem. Then we've got this one over here as well. Uh, other option is to go over this way? This will be a, maybe a tougher battle. But then we get some money. Uh... Okay. Go for the extra cash. I really don't probably don't need to move it at all, really. This battle will probably be a pretty simple soft touch there, but if we do one here, and then I guess this would be another pretty simple battle here. Or we could do just these two. Or we could do the one for the food and... And the money. I think this will just do... Some, like, shield damage on our way in. I, well, we're hoped enough that we can take care of this. Yeah, because what are they going to do? Oh no, 25 damage. Oh. I hope that went against shields. Okay, it didn't. <laughs> All right, um, shouldn't be an issue. Uh, doesn't look like we need to outspeed these fucks, I don't think, so let's get shields up. Uh, break that guy in the next week. He's got the light attack boost. Oh, we can't do that there. Ah, uh, why can't we target him? Okay, we could do the free stun. Or we could do the stun there and get him out the field. Uh, we could push him back twice. We can just target him. I need to move him back by 45, though, so that's 15. There's 30. That might do enough? Well, we'd have to push him back more than 15, though. We would need to get him back. Damn, I don't have something that'll... Okay, we got... Oh, but that would target that guy instead. Uh, yeah, that's not going to be enough. Damn, I guess the other option is... Well, we do fucking massive AoE attack here again. That pushes one... That pushes the bottom dude into next week. And then does a not bad amount of damage to top dude either. So, uh... And it does 50% armor piercing. That's fucking great. Yeah, do it. Do it. That's a good combo. I like it. <laughs> I like it a lot, in fact. Alright. And then we're just dealing with pushing this other fucker back by, I guess, 20. Oh, why? He's already pushed in the next week. Why do I have to go through his other dipshit friend here? Okay, that's not going to do much. We'll be fine. I think we'll be fine here, yeah? Oh, right, because Big Boom Slam dude doesn't get to go this turn anyway, so... So if we... Focus him down as best we can. Oh, or we could boost plus 25% to crit damage. That's pretty good. Or we could just whittle away. 
Oh, that's the one we got. Well, I don't know if I should bother trying to push him back. He's gonna get to go this round anyways. So we may as well just chip away at this fucko. No. Oh no. Okay. No, let's just chip away at this big boy. <laughs> Okay, well, we'll take the, take the bop on the chin there, that's fine. Um, now... Push it back a little bit. Okay, so we can push this guy back twice. I am curious if we can... Oh, that's not enough to kill. Not enough to kill, but it might be enough to... Okay, there's a kill there. I'd probably be better off restoring shields. Yeah. Even if she takes... a bot from him, she'll still be... good shape. Oh, plus we've got another attack here anyways. Uh, can we... Target the other fucker? No? Okay, fine. Then just... Then just kill him. <laughs> or, or chip damage him. I don't care. Doesn't matter at this point. Boom, boom, bam. I was hoping the burning damage would take care of him, but that's fine. We'll... Boost shields to front runner. She'll be able to take that on the chin, no problem. And he's toast anyway from the burning damage, like I said. So that's good. Um, and then we essentially get a free turn. So this fucker's gonna eat it. <laughs> it's gonna eat it from a four on one here. Boom. Gets the kill though. If whoever goes last is gonna get the kill. Looks like our uh, spiritual robo dude gets the kill. Good job. Excellent. We get that, plus some extra money from the AA cannon, plus this extra money here. And then we have one more Batool. So which one do we take? Do we take this one here? I wish we could go all the way to that dude, but we've only got one that we can do. I should have thought of that earlier, but... Or we take this one here and get the food, which we probably won't need. But, you know, bonuses are bonuses, so let's go do that one. This fight shouldn't be that much of a problem anyways. Oh, it even tells me what dudes are involved. We have four on four matchup. We got it. Mm, okay. Got the initial attack there, which I don't like. That's fine. Um, we don't need to out these fucks. So let's turn on shield regen. And what are we dealing with here? Looks like our front runner is going to take a lot of attacks. As expected. So what can we do about that? We can do our uh, big boom slam AoE, which will push looks like at least two of them into next week. But maybe we've got a solution without doing that. Just move that guy into next week immediately. Um, who's the first one to go here? 
Oh, of course, it's the dude in back, so, alright. Could burn a stun there. That's 15 Fury gone. If I'm gonna do that, I may as well just do the combo, right? Or this one, and he'll be pretty much toast anyways on the next attack. to work this out without using any of our uh, fury points there. So that'll push him back a little bit. Um, only other attack I'm going to get is Sunder, right? Okay, that'll push him back entirely. Can we do that and also push one of the other ones off the board? for this round. It would have to be like a combo bit from... this guy and then maybe that guy. There's not going to be any kills involved. That's what happens if I do that. That'll be an additional break but not prevents our front runner probably from taking a shield bop. Oh, cause that one's operating first, so that won't, that'll push one off, but also prevent another from being pushed off. So what happens if I bestow shield? That's not gonna be, it's gonna happen too late. She'll take the hit to her health. Let's back that up then. Um, if we get. Put a defend in there, and then. Maybe a light pushback, and then. Push back there. Still taking full shield damage, that sucks. Okay. About that. Oh shit, I. That was all things. <laughs> well, I hope that works. Guess we'll find out. Okay, so there's one broken out of here. There's two broken out of here. Um, and then with hopefully her defense, she won't take a hit to hell. She did a little bit, anyways. Fuck. That's right. That wasn't that bad, though. A little bit of shield regen there. And now we just need to... And what happens if we do, like, the big boom slam AoE? We're gonna get a double kill, and the others that... The two that aren't gonna get murdered here are extremely fucking weak. So, uh, yeah, may as well do it. Fuck it. God, that's a big hit. I love it. The two that aren't killed outright... Oh, they are killed outright. <laughs> Never mind. Oh no, the other two. The two that weren't killed outright got broken into next week. I like it. Okay. And now it's gonna be just, you know what? Double, double tap these fuckos and they're dead. Very effective. Bam. Excellent. Okay. Food stuff I don't care about. Let's see, can we do two level ups? No. Well, no, we've got 90. We well could do two level ups, but light attack. Plus it does burning and bleeding. Oh man, that's sick. What does this do? Oh, Staggers by 15% more. Oh, but only if they don't have shields or armor. That sucks. Uh, oh, shield regen. It's pretty fucking good. And it gets rid of debuffs and DOTs. I like that. <sighs> I 
think either way, I need my frontliner to be upgraded. It's going to be important. And then I guess we're down to this, right? Which I'll want his extra camping bit anyway, so that's, that's the choice there. Now we will be in position to fight the big bad. With mostly full everything. Oops, uh, that's the wrong direction. Mostly full health. Got a little bit of armor left. Would have preferred to have better armor, but that's okay. But, uh, here we are. Well, uh, we're gonna do the big bad fight next time, I think. We're at a good, good time to stop. And uh, everybody's all I, like the the first battle this night was the 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 big worry because we almost lost our healer immediately in that fight. But otherwise we've been doing okay here. So go ahead and save and exit to menu and, and pick this up next time. So that'll do it for tonight. Next stream will be tomorrow night, 7:30 p.m. CDT. It'll be Shmup Book Club. Uh, some more Ginga Force or Universe or Spriggan Mark II. Friday, Saturday, we're off, and then Sunday, 7 p.m. CDT. It'll be a long play, so back to Talos Principle 2. Uh, more of the DLC puzzles. And then next Monday, 7 p.m. CDT, we'll be back here with Star Renegades. Having a good time with this game. This is this is fun. We get to plan shit out. Uh, we get to read some flavor text. It's, it's a really fun game. I like it. I'm enjoying it so far. All right, that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.